Legislation that would legalize a controversial treatment for children with severe epilepsy is moving ahead in Utah and South Carolina. It uses oil derived from marijuana. For now, it's only available in Colorado, and Barry Peterson has more. Aaron Kleppinger considers this a miracle cure, the daily dose of liquid marijuana extract known as Charlotte's Web, given to his eight-year-old son, Hunter. Hunter. The Kleppingers believe it controls seizures so severe they caused brain damage. Traditional epilepsy drugs were ineffective for Hunter. The Kleppingers say the extract has reduced the frequency of seizures from as many as 100 a day to as few as two a week. Dawn is Hunter's mother. When he was on pharmaceuticals, he was screaming all the time or sleeping all the time or having more seizures. So he's well, more alert and more happy than he used to be. Come on, let's go. The Kleppingers moved to Colorado, where recreational and medical marijuana is allowed, from Georgia, where any use of marijuana is illegal. I feel horrible that a child's zip code is what determines their ability to get medicine that could potentially save their lives. And this medicine, you think, can? Absolutely, I think it can. Legislators in 12 states are considering proposals to allow a version of Charlotte's Web to be produced or sold legally. The extract has a very low dose of THC, the chemical in marijuana that gives people a high. Parents believe other chemicals in the extract reduce the seizures. But there is no scientific study to prove the effectiveness and safety of Charlotte's Web to treat epilepsy. We have real reason to be concerned about Dr. Amy Brooks Kyle is first vice president of the American Epilepsy Society. She worries that parents are sailing into uncharted waters. We do know from basic science studies that marijuana derivatives can completely stop the cellular mechanisms of learning and memory. And right now, I don't know the benefits. I don't know the likelihood it's going to help. And I know nothing about the risks. There are about 200 parents in Colorado using the extract, half who moved from out of state to use it legally. Okay. Dangerous or not, it is to them the best hope for their own miracle against epilepsy. That's it. Barry Peterson, CBS News, Colorado Springs.